we're going to see if the game audio is too loud or not. We're diving into inside here. I wanted to play this game a minute ago, but it wasn't free. Yeah, I'm a cheapskate by now. Oh well, it is what it is. Yeah. It's free now. It's on the Game Pass, so. Let's get it. Is it frozen? Oh. Oh. Uh, do I hit A? Alright. I watched the whole gameplay of this game. It's very weird what it's about now that I think about it. Wait, this game is pretty dark. I might have to cut like ahead 10 seconds here, but I need to close the blinds. Alright, we're back. It's still pretty dark and hard to see. So I might have to close my window, but we'll see. Let's get into it. I'm not going to have any music over this because um, I want it to be eerie. And you just focus on my monotone voice, if it's monotone. I am told I am like robotic, stoic, whatever, sadly. Doesn't make for a good gamer, YouTuber, but you know, maybe I'll ramble about something interesting. Oh, this game is interesting. Oh, it was reversed. I wonder what's the speed run for this game. You're seeing what other buttons there are, if any. Oh shoot, oh shoot. Okay. That wasn't the best option. Right at the very beginning we failed. Oh well. Okay, so they hear us. That was super easy to do. I was just impatient. Um, how do I push this? B? Okay. They definitely should have heard that. This game is actually pretty normal looking at the start. This just seems like it's around a big facility. Uh, I beg your pardon? Missing something? I am. Do I slide it down? Oh no no no. That did like time would jump. No. I do have to push it. Yeah, this game just looks nice. Even for my original Xbox one that is on. It just looks nice. Oh my goodness, that dog is extremely fast. Am I supposed to outrun it? I am. I dare you to jump this. There's no way that dog should have been that fast. There's no way. I'm 
pretty sure water is like a dog's weakness. Or any four like the animal. What's that sound? Oh shoot, okay. Oh, that's a dart. <laughs> I thought they popped me. So they just keep running? Wait. I think I do. I might, I might just have to full sender. Yeah, I think I got a full sender. I remember this from the video. You gotta like hop down to go left. Oh, this is like semi frustrating. I wonder how long I should make these videos, if they should be like long playthroughs or not. Maybe like about 30 minutes, I don't know. Goodness. second. There's clear light. I can be seen. Oh my goodness. Run. Oh. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. It's dark for crying out loud. I mean, I guess that tripping scene is more realistic when it comes to movies now. Boom. That is. Oh my. What am I possibly supposed to do? Ah, <sighs> this beginning is already tough as it is. And I fell again. Here it goes. I feel like I tripped. Oh, quick time events kind of. Oh. It's gonna not trip. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this guy's extremely lucky. <laughs> there was water. This feels like. Oh, wait. How do I go underwater? Uh. This feels like um, one of those communist escape videos. Like, I remember a video from someone escaping from North Korea. Definitely took a bit of luck, but once he was over, he was over. And this feels similar. Like, I wonder what's the context of me even being in the woods to begin with. But look at the graphics, man. I kind of just, I'm going to take a screenshot. I'm taking a screenshot. Let me just look at this. It's just similar to a game that I remember seeing a long time ago. In the Game Informer. But I never found that Game Informer again.
this way right here for safety. Just look at this, man. Look at this. So green, miserable. Okay. All right there. Oh, I didn't even notice it a little. Oh. But yeah, some upper body strength. here. Maybe I have to time this. These little um, chicks remind me of when I was at Camp Kadima like many years ago when I was a kid. I held a chick in my hand and it just dug into my hand and I dropped it. <laughs> Reaction, but that's just reminded me. And it was fine, and you know, it's light, so. I mean, I'm just gonna make excuses for dropping the chick. I'm trying to figure out what I need to do. If I get stuck here, I might just have to go and cut this out. I don't know. Okay, so. I need something to knock that off. I don't know what I could possibly use though. I wonder if I can just grab one of these. No. I'm just going to hold B or stand B. Like I, I don't even, I don't even know how any of this works. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm at the cut.
Okay. Alright. I mean, it's only been like 20 seconds, but I just figured out what I need to do. I need to suck the... I need to be able to get these uh, little chicks sucked into the bottom of this thing. I gotta bring them this far, right? I'm pretty sure at least. And then I just gotta run. And boom. Sorry, teammate. Oh, I thought they would die, but alright. It works too. I would definitely not trust this ladder. Oh my goodness, it's wet on the bottom. <laughs> hey, this is a game. Oh yeah, we're falling through, I can tell. Oh, I guess not. Okay, this is not Assassin's Creed. Surely brick. What the? Oh no. Oh no. Uh uh. That is. Ugh. Rabbit, look at this crap. I wouldn't get anywhere near this thing if I saw worms. Ugh. They're coming from pig corpses. What in the world? Yeah, I think I'll do this one as like a 30 minute one. Because to make any progression, let's just look at that. To make any progression, I think it has to be like 30 minutes. Because to think and solve this stuff is going to be a while. So I don't think there's any way around that. I'll cut if I get stuck, but... Yeah. Definitely like the eerie, focused environment, though. No music to distract you or comfort you. Oh my goodness. Alright. That's a... That's a slight little... That's a slight little jump scare. I just had the feeling that I needed to jump. Okay. Here we go. Take. Oh. That is utterly disgusting. Oh. I think I was supposed to jump off. Wait. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Yo. That is. Oh my goodness. That's like one of my pet peeves. That's like, not pet peeves, something that's like an irk. Where it's like a slime or like a worm that can somehow move a bunch and like get into your brain or something and like control you. Because I wanted to be painful and then you'd be alive and awake and aware. And you 
can't do anything about it. And it's like you're not dead, so you're just trapped. It's like those people who are stuck in comas, they're aware, but they can't do anything. I just imagine that, but a worm. That's why it's more like a fear for me. But then again, that's the alien worms that jump and stuff. Look at this. So I think I would have been one of them if, like, you know, I get captured and stuff. I don't Worm things are. Like just, just, just imagine you're chilling and then you wake up and it's just one right over you, goes right down your throat, takes you over, like, or goes in your ear or something. Now, granted, when you leave things to the imagination, it may be worse than it seems, but I don't know. Assuming before I get myself killed. Okay. Uh I should have seen that coming. I was watching it pull. Oh, okay, good. They knew what they were doing. Okay. Oh, okay. I either got to jump back or I got to fall through that hole. Yeah, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to fall through the hole. Alright, let's get her done. What? Oh my goodness. So I gotta jump for it. Here we go. I think 
can say you reach a terminal velocity after six seconds of falling. I mean, after six seconds, you're, you're, you're pretty done in. I wonder if there's any secret or anything. Uh, wait, so what's this then? I'm assuming that was that a secret or was that a puzzle? Safe falling and hard landings. Hold on, I got achievement. I don't understand that. It says safe fallings and hard landings. Wait, so that must mean this is like part one done. Okay, I'm going to stop it here. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed part one. Um, I'm definitely going to play this game through and through. 30 minutes plus per part. I'm assuming once I get the achievement, I've like passed a chapter or a sequence or something. So, yeah. I'm going to do another one. But of course, you're going to have to follow the schedule. One of this, one of the philosophy or religious videos, so on and so forth. And then, back to it. Alright, see you guys in the next one.